Hey everybody, it's Joe. Today is, I don't know, what is it, the 28th of August. And back uh, about two months ago, at the end of June, I took a body composition test. Say hi to a half-naked Ava Kalea. Can you say hi, Ava? Look at the camera over here. Say hi. Um, back two months ago, I took a body comp test. Uh, here in San Diego, tested out at 11.7% body fat, which was a little bit higher than I wanted to, and I think I was about 167 pounds or something. Yeah, more ice cream in a minute. So um, then I promptly used July not to get better, but actually I gained 27 pounds in less than 30 days. So I went, to, I got to 190. Um, then I just got sick of feeling fat. Kind of spent the last month yo-yoing back and forth. I'm back up around 190 right now. Most of it from pizza and ice cream, uh, and that's with no beer either. Um, so anyway, I'm kind of just been feeling a little disgusted with myself. I've still been working out, just not as hard not as consistently um, been eating like a pig like I said a lot of pizza a lot of ice cream a lot of stuff that I would not eat hardly at all in the last five years um, started eating a lot healthier right before I turned 50 but for the last two months that has generally not been the case and I don't think it's healthy for anyone to gain 27 pounds or um, more especially with the yo-yo in you know 30 to 60 days I've been up and down 10 pounds just in the last week so um, it's pretty crazy so anyway I kind of got sick sick of um, myself sick of feeling slow and lethargic and fat and but it's really embarrassing I can't even take my shirt off it's disgusting me so what I did I took the plunge and I joined a program called fitness genes and I met a guy named Dr. Dan at a fitness show here in San Diego a couple months ago and I was really considering uh, doing the program it sounds really neat it has to do with DNA, DNA testing and uh, they create a specific program based on your DNA my one hesitation was I'm a little um, uneasy about having my DNA information out there um, for no really logical reason outside you know I'm not worried about myself but for my kids if there's something up with my DNA or you know saying in the future they, society doesn't like people with a certain chromosome or whatever um, I just didn't want that information out there but after talking to a lot of scientists and people that work with genetics um, you know they say the potential benefits outweigh the potential risks and that was good enough for me so I went ahead and ordered this fitness genes test this is um, this is it this is the first time I'm seeing it so it's kind of an unveiling this they shipped it out They're they're located in the UK they have an office in Santa Monica just up the road but um, this was shipped from Georgia so it took a few days to get it here it's a fitness jeans don't know if you can see that because of the glare uh, fitness jeans and it's a data collection kit and from my understanding I just do it a swab of my mouth and that's it so I am going to um, just quickly read the instructions here Please register this kit now at secure.fitnessgenes.com. We are unable to process your sample unless it is registered. So I'll go ahead and do that afterwards. Um, let's see. It says record your name and unique barcode located on the collection tube in the space below and keep it in a safe place. Number two, collect your saliva sample according to the instructions inside the kit, which I guess is this. 
Okay, no food or drink for 30 minutes. So I'm not going to be able to do this right now. I'm going to have to come back because I just uh, ate a little bit of ice cream <laughs> um, with Ava. And I've been drinking a lot of water. So uh, I'm going to have to wait for 30 to 60 minutes before I can actually fill this up. So come back uh, then and do the do the deal. In the meantime, I'll go ahead and register this online. Thanks for watching. Okay, it's Joe back again. It's uh, waited a couple hours since eating or drinking. I'm gonna do this saliva collection for the fitness genes test. Um, this is the Origin DX for the collection of human DNA. This is a DNA test I'm doing. Okay, so we're gonna, never done this before, so I'm gonna follow the directions. Okay, it says spit until the amount of saliva, not bubbles, reaches the fill line. God, I'm gonna be spitting a long time, apparently. I thought it was just gonna be a swab. What are you doing, Mitch? Okay, Ava Kaleas wants to help. We don't need your water to spit. So, um, this is, I don't know if you can see that, but the fill line's way up there. And it is kind of a thick tube, so I'm going to need to get some saliva here. Mm, that didn't even make a divot. We might be here for a couple of seconds. Um, in the meantime, while I was waiting, um, you're not supposed to have the food or um, you're not supposed to have food or, or drink for an hour beforehand. I think it was. Um, I'll confirm that in a minute. No, we're not going to listen to mommy song. We're making a video right now. So. Um, I did go on their website, Fit, uh, Fitness Genes, and register the kit. There's all kinds of great information there. I took a, a couple of different uh, surveys, mo uh, mostly about my background, but also about uh, my fitness habits, my eating habits, and that sort of thing. And I'm kind of all in on this. I'm trying to. Um, see how this works for uh, anybody else out there that wants to and any of my my clients and um, just kind of doing the, the whole deal so I opted in to give them access to my information to help make their tests better or their program better um, and hopefully learn as much as possible about um, how I can improve and make myself better so, as far as my physical activity and nutrition and I'm really looking forward to getting a personalized kind of uh, uh, let's see okay well it might not be as much as I'm thinking because it looks like I'm already close to the line. I guess it doesn't fill up all the way to the bottom. So that's good. Um, for some reason, I usually drink tons of water and have lots of saliva, but it's really humid today and I don't seem to have a lot of saliva. Okay, so just one more little bit and we should be good. The little girl doesn't really understand what's happening. Okay, so looks to me like we have enough. What we're going to do is, I've uh, got so many different instructions. Okay, let's see here. Fill the line. Then we are going to um, 
Hold the tube upright with one hand, close the funnel lid with the other. Okay. So, um, make sure the lid's closed tightly. Hold the tube upright. Unscrew the funnel from the tube. I guess there was some liquid in there that got released when I shut it. So I want to unscrew the funnel from the tube and now I want to put this cap on I believe. Let's see. Okay. And then I am going to screw this cap on like this and shake the cap tube for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And then it's ready to go. So somewhere around here in all my disposable so I got tons of stuff to write reviews on for Amazon today um, so then I'm just gonna put it in this handy dandy I guess a specimen bag bio specimen bag place tube with small cap in bag peel off blue liner and seal by pressing down on the glue line so Put this on, put this in. Um, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with this white part. But the blue liner is supposed to come off. Okay, there we go. And so it's in there. And now, go ahead and ship the box, put it in the box. It's already pre addressed to Fitness Jeans in Midland, Georgia. First class postage. I'm gonna peel this off right there and it's ready to go so we're gonna go take this and put it in the mail and uh, tomorrow or later on tonight it will be on its way to Georgia and we'll be able to log in anytime to see what the process is so um, anyway I'm excited that I took my first and maybe only DNA test and you're gonna find out all about your daddy and hopefully we'll be able to get a really nice uh, personalized workout and nutrition program so that I can get to my goal as quickly as possible. My goal is 90 days after, um, hopefully we can get started around September 1st or so, maybe a couple days later than that. But September, October, November, by December 1st I should be a, where I want to be, or at least uh, a great improvement so anyway thanks for watching this long rambling video this has been uh, showing you how to take the DNA test for fitness genes thank you so much for watching and uh, subscribe so you can watch the next video once I get the results